We're getting ready for the 106th running of the Indianapolis 500. One of the great drivers, one of the most distinguished drivers, and certainly one of the most handsome. I, I, it, 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 uh, I knew that. It's uh, Tony Kanan <laughs> has joined us, and uh, I know for you, it's great to be back in the This is like your home, right? Oh, well, it is, right? Obviously, I know you know this, but I, I moved to Indy four right. years ago with my family, so this is home. Yeah. But, you know, the fans at this place and obviously the, this racetrack always made me feel my home and, uh, you know, Pretty fortunate to still be doing this. Yeah, well, we were all cheering when you won it. God, that was so cool. Was and awesome. you're in great shape this season. You're way up there in the be- at the front of the pack. Yeah, I mean, we obviously racing for a great team with Chip Ganassi Racing, American Legion. Obviously, we put five cars in the top 12. Um, and uh, a great team effort, I think. Obviously, that was just qualifying. Now we need to get ready for the race. But, um, yeah, it was, uh, it's been a great month so far. You famously have a tattoo Yep. Can you tell me about it? Yeah, I mean, when I won the 500 in 2013, I decided to, um, you know, make the the bricks and the Borg Warner Trophy uh, tattooed in my arm. So my entire uh, right arm is actually the whole trophy with the name of my kids, the date of the race, and the the car number, and so on. So I, the obvious question is, if you win it again, we'll add that more. You you add it to that same, or do you do the other side? No, we now the other side is taken already. <laughs> so we add, we'll finish the sleeve uh, for. You know, people don't know, but it goes to my, my elbow. So I still left the rest of the forearm to add the other trophy. Okay, okay. With, the, with having that many cars up front and that many teammates, um, is there an opportunity to work together, to stay up front? Like, have you guys talked about that? I mean, it feels like the rest of the field and their teammates are a little more spread out, but you guys being closer together could be an advantage. No, 100%. We, we obviously, we talk, you know, we're going to try not to get in each other's way until... It's 20 laps to go. And after that, it's every man for themselves. But, yeah, we talked about it. We're going to – obviously, we have four cars in the fast six, so in the top six. So uh, we, uh, we're going to work together for sure in the beginning of the race. What um, – it seemed like the speeds jumped dramatically this year. Is there anything to that? Was it really that weather or was you know specific? Or was there data leading up to uh, practice and qualifying that, that kind of said this was, this was what to expect? It was a combination of many things, but obviously the engines are better too. The weather helped, and we made a couple of changes in the car aerodynamically to make the race better for the fans that actually helped us go through the corners quicker with less drag in the straights. So it was, you know, it's, it's one of those things. It was a combination of a bunch of things, and I honestly, you know, I actually had a, a debate with a couple of fans on Twitter prior to qualifying that we were not be going that fast, and uh, I had to bite my thumb. Well, you are now known as TK. Did you have a nickname uh, back home in Brazil? Yeah, Big Nose. Big Nose? wonder why. Even as a kid? Yeah. Well, you know, the thing is, <laughs> apparently, the only thing that was already big enough when I was little was my nose. It never actually, I grow around it. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, great. Have a great race. Tony Kanan, one of Thank the greats. Thank you, Thanks so much for your time. Thank you.